What's going on everyone? Sorry I didn't get the video out for uh, Monday's workout. Uh, things were kind of swamped with the new release of the updated reopening plans from the state. I was diving into those reports and whatnot. That is on me, I'm sorry, it won't happen again. But here I am to bring you today's wad. Uh, it's Tuesday, May 19th, and uh, we have a good strength and a nice long wad on deck for today. So the strength today is going to be eight rounds of 20 seconds of max sit-ups, 10 seconds of a hollow hold, 20 seconds max glute bridges, and 10 seconds glute bridge hold. This is all gonna be done back to back to back to back with no rest, rest in the process of doing the movements if needed, very short and quick since the rounds are short and quick. Um, try to take a quick break, catch a breath, and get right back into it. Um, so when the clock starts, we're going to do max sit-ups, so our feet are going to be together, we're going to come back, backs on the ground, hands touch, come back up, shoulders come past the hips. Max reps for 20 seconds. As soon as that 20 seconds is up, we're going to come back and immediately get into a hollow hold and hold it here for 10 seconds. This is also another variation, or here is the small scale variation to maintain good form. After the 10 seconds of the hollow hold, we're getting into max glute bridges. So we're going to come right down here, and we're going to send our hips up to the sky, squeezing those glutes. Max reps. At the end of 20 seconds, we're going to hold this glute bridge for 10 seconds, squeezing those glutes, keeping the hips in the sky, core is tight, and then we come back down and start right from the top, and that's eight rounds of that, so eight minutes total. All right. So, now, the lot today is called Long Beach, it is four time. It's gonna start with one round of 160 double unders, or 320 single unders, an 800 meter run, and 40 burpees. It's then gonna go into two rounds of 80 double unders, or 160 singles, 400 meter run, and 20 burpees. And then finally, you're gonna end it with three rounds of 40 double unders or 80 single unders, a 200 meter run, and 10 burpees. All right, so we have three different phases of this workout, a longer piece with one round, working its way down to a shorter piece with three rounds. All right, so for the double unders, if you don't have roughly 75 to 100 consecutive double unders or pretty quickly consecutive double unders, you want to try to scale this down. You don't want to spend all day on these 160 double unders um, trying to get up to that high number. So either scale that back to a number that you can achieve or set a time limit to practice your double unders on. And the first round will be roughly about three minutes. All right? If you're doing singles or hops, we're going to do hops forward and back, and then singles, you just double the reps. Um, on the run, 800 meter run, um, Nothing really to this. Make sure you get your measurements outside. I think it's going to be a nice day, so make sure you get outside, get some sunshine. Um, you do want to kind of push it on these runs. Um, not too much, but you want to go a little bit faster than your typical recovery pace. And just try to lean forward a little bit into it. Let gravity take its place. And uh, small choppy steps leaning forward will allow you to move a little bit faster um, with using less energy. And then finally, you're going to get into 40 burpees. This is the longest piece of burpees in this first round. So take them slow and steady. You want to breathe uh, through these since it's a lot of reps. You're going to take one deep breath in. At the bottom, exhale, breathe in, come back up, exhale. So you should be breathing, exhaling at the top of the movement and at the bottom of the movement, keeping that oxygen flowing into the lungs making sure that that energy is getting there. All right, step up burpees are also an option, um, making sure that we're moving consistently through these. And then next we're gonna get into the second part of it, which is two rounds of 80 double unders and 160 singles. Same idea um, with the double unders. Try to cut it back to say a minute and a half of practice on these double unders if you don't have them consistently. And then we're going off on a 400 meter run, so about half the distance of the run in the first half of the workout. Um, same type of idea, try to push it on these runs, lean forward, short choppy steps, and again, same thing with the breathing on the burpees, forgot to mention this. Try to take an inhale for two steps and then exhale for two steps, and try to stay on a consistent basis. When your body realizes that oxygen is coming in consistently, it stays calmer and you're able to work more and produce more energy. And then 
finally, you're finishing it off with 20 burpees, same idea as the first round. And then finally, the last piece of this is three rounds of 40 double unders or 80 singles, same idea, try to limit it to 60 seconds of practice, or 45 seconds of practice, sorry, or you're doing 80 singles or hops. And then you're going off on a 200 meter run. This is the shortest run of the workout, so really try to push it on this one. The distance is not as long as the first two pieces, so we really want to try to push the pace on this, get down there and get back and get into those 10 burpees. And then same idea on the burpees, make sure we're breathing. We can go a little bit faster on this last piece since it's not as many reps. All right, so you really want to kind of work your way through this workout, conserving your energy on the first piece, expelling a little bit more energy in the middle, and then really firing it home in the last round. Uh, this workout can be made or break. It can make it or break it in the first piece. If you go way too hot, the rest of the workout is not going to be pleasant. If you pace it the right way and you work through it quickly but smart, you're going to find yourself in a good position to work through the rest of these pieces of the workout all the way to the end with a good time and a good pace, nice and strong. All right? Any questions on this, shoot me an email, send me a text message. Um, other than that, get after it today with this longer piece. Pace yourself, work hard, and stay safe.